is up, gearheads. Welcome on into the Thursday Thunder Series, the ARN Thursday Thunder Series. I'm Alan Bailey. We are in race number two. Bats is over on the couch with Mommy, who's on her lunch break because she can. I'm getting rid of my sandals because I don't need them right now. So welcome on in. If you guys are watching on YouTube, make sure that you check us out every Thursday at uh, 3 p.m. Pacific, or excuse me, 3 p.m. Eastern, noon Pacific, over on twitch.tv forward slash Hey Alan Bailey. So we are heading out to Auto Club, so let's get on in this because I don't want to waste any more time. Is the enemy drowning? I'm trying to get my my chat open on my phone so that I could put it in front of me and just kind of like watch the chat, just because I want to keep up on the chat as much as humanly possible. All right. So Auto Club's my home track. Um, I felt going here was a lot better than heading out to Kansas. Uh, so this season is kind of uh, simulating real life in 2022, but it's also kind of my own thing, um, just because I can. Clear out, hammer down. Oh, hammer down. Hammer's down. Man, I love this place. I truly hope that they don't turn it into a half mile, but at the same time, I want them to turn it into a half mile because it took 10, 12 years for racing to get great out here with the surface wearing in. And unless they can figure out how to age the surface, uh, repaving it doesn't make any sense. And um, maybe they can, there's technology. Like maybe they can honestly, um, you know, do something cool with it. I'm not, I, I don't work in that field. So maybe they can, maybe they can't, but the track needs to be resurfaced. There's no doubt about it. Um, but it's just such a cool track because there's so many grooves. There's so many ways around here. The speeds are so ridiculously high that it produces phenomenal racing. It's one of the best races we saw in 2022 so far. That in Darlington, these old worn out surfaces just work very well with the new car. And this surface is wonderful. I have many fond memories at this racetrack, but at the same time, I hate the media center. I hate the parking. Everything at this place is very aged and dated with that uh, mid nineties feel. And um, on top of that, the place was originally designed for indie cars, so the garages are so atrociously bad. They need a new garage uh, layout and configuration for these Cup, Xfinity, and Truck Series guys. That's why Truck Series doesn't race here for the most part, because having all three series at one racetrack is such, at this track, is such a difficult task with how uh, the garage area is set up. You got guys who are crammed two cars into one garage stall so they're literally inches apart from each other and it's just so awkward for these teams and drivers and as you can see we're running pretty well car's actually not that bad I don't want to fine tooth adjust this thing too much because I don't want to do that I don't want to you know have a custom setup in it that's going to take me and set me on fire you know and, and get through this field like there's no tomorrow so Oh, she definitely a tiny bit unstable, though. She's good as is, actually. I'm going to finish this lap up and see what we do here, because this was a little bit of an off lap for me. And we'll see how we are. All right. That's not bad. So we're going to return to the garage. You can see our laps right there. Tires are premium here, so... Let's go. I just I forgot that I have Jeff Gordon as my spotter. I prefer TJ. Oops. I don't know where I was going. 
Drop it in the comments, y'all. What do you guys prefer with this track out in Fontana, California? Do you prefer a two mile track or do you prefer the half mile? The half mile we're gonna race in uh, in our 2003 at some point with uh, the new series coming to the channel sometime soon. And I'm still debating. So originally I was gonna have it run on Thursdays, part of Thursday Night Thunder or Thursday Thunder series, I should say. And honestly, it's 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 so big and grandiose. It's like, do I want to stream it or do I just want to put it up on the YouTube channel? So I don't know. I'm on the fence about it. Let me know what you guys think, because I'm curious to hear what you guys have to say about it. All right, let's go. Let's go. We're good. Oh, she's a little loose. OK. She was a little unstable there. That's gonna cost us here. We're gonna qualify mid-pack here, it looks like. That's what it feels like. Maybe in the back, I don't know. Hopefully it's decent for us. Hey, pole award at the hometown track. I thought we were gonna be mid-pack. I thought that lap was horrible, but okay. We will take it. We will take it, gearheads. We all qualified the Toyotas. I mean, we're in a Toyota, but still. So an all Toyota front row at essentially Toyota's hometown track, so all right. Oh, a couple of last bites of food. Oh. Oh. We got a hundred laps out here. I gotta eat up, man. <laughs> I've been to essentially, I think, every race out here. I don't remember not going to a race out here, so. And yes, we're on the pole. I dig it. We're going green. Are you ready? No. Let's go. <clears throat> so 11 laps. Oh, we're going to have like 10 pit stops. Because we got 100 laps out here at Auto Club Speedway. It's uh, 250 miles out here today. Oh, we Kyle Bush and flat at it. Put, put, we sent it into turns one and two, and it worked, y'all. Nice little hefty lead. We're going to be pitting in about 10 laps. All right, one lap down, 99 to go. I wish there was kind of an, an alternative, sincerely, with this because um, I, the options are I can, ooh, I got a little loose on that apron. The options are I can run 25% uh, or 50%. There's no 30, 40, I'd like to run like a 35% race, maybe, maybe a 40, not a 50. It's, this is a lot of racing admittingly, so drop it in the comments. What do you guys prefer, 25 or 50? I'm not even really going to worry about these tires because 10 laps, you know, this is Brickyard. This is like 2008 Brickyard 400 status here, where we're gonna just have to pit every 10 laps. So I can I can burn these tires up in 10 laps, but I'm not gonna burn them up that dramatically. I don't think. Oh, uh. grip up any time now, car. She had a nice little slide right there. Well, we got a nice little two-second lead right now over uh, MTJ right there. I'm very curious to see if Martin comes back next season. Honestly, it's kind of... The ball's in his court. It's, oh, just grip up any chance you want. Car, yeesh. Um, yeah, so the ball's kind of in his court, whether he wants to come back or not. Um... I don't know, man. I hope he does, but at the same time, you got Ty Gibbs waiting in the wings. So, I think that uh, if I were Chris Bell, I'd be I'd be sweating bullets because, uh, depending on what Martin Truex Jr. decides, either MTJ is going to be in the 19 or Gibbs is Ty Gibbs. 
And if MTJ's in the 19, who do you think is going to be in the 20 car next year? It ain't going to be Chris Bell. Let me tell you that. If, if MTJ uh, takes off, or sticks around, I should say. Because Gibbs, Ty Gibbs is, is biting at the chomps to get up into the Cup Series. And if I were Mr. Gibbs, I would be uh, I would be getting him in a Cup car for at least a handful of starts this season. Uh, with preparations to get ready for next year. Because it's a driver's car. And clearly, whether you love him or you hate him, Ty Gibbs can wheel a car. Yeah, he's in the best equipment, but he can wheel a car. And uh, right now... Denny's not going anywhere. Kyle is is waiting for the uh, the ink to dry on a sponsorship deal so he can get paid, and he's all grumpy about that because he wants more money because he's greedy. Meh. And I get it. Go out and get paid, but there, there's there's crazy stupid rich, and then there's paying a surrogate to carry your baby because your wife didn't want to, and paying to have a photo shoot from your son's perspective. For social media if you're paying a photographer and videographer to take photos of your kids reaction let alone your own reaction to your daughter coming home that's a whole nother level of, of uh rich so kyle bush samantha bush brexton and lennox bush they uh they're filthy rich and uh kyle doesn't need more money he wants more money because you know greed but uh, Kyle is quickly and, and rapidly losing his value as a Cup Series driver. Mark my words, he's losing his value as a Cup Series driver because um, he's a guy who doesn't consistently win. His last two wins in the Cup Series, he backed into, literally. He won at the Daytona Road Course uh, two years ago because literally the leaders crashed and he was running third. And he won... Um, at Bristol because the leaders crashed and he backed into a win. So he's literally not capable, in my opinion, of winning a race on his own these days. Everything he backs into. So if I were a sponsor looking at him, he's not going to represent my brand in a way that I want it represented. Um, and he isn't going out there and performing. He's a two-time champ, yes, but he has no Daytona 500s. Uh, he's won at the Brickyard. That's great. I don't believe he's won a Coke 600 off the top of my head, but he's a guy who literally has, is, is quickly and rapidly losing his value, and his attitude is not helping his situation. Here we go. First pit stops of the day. We're going to go ahead and... Car's fine, actually, so let's just pit and see how we do. Coming out first. Looks like nobody in the top 10 lost or gained anything, so that's good. Yes, let's go. All right, let's see what we got here. So we're going to have to pit with about 78 to go, roughly. Man, this car is just a rocket, y'all, on these restarts. We're able to actually pull. Oh, here was the problem. Somebody spun off of two. That's That's tragic. But a half a second lead going down the back straightaway already. We got to run through one and two. Three and four is another story altogether. There we go. On new tires, we're like Superman, you know. But when the tires start to wear, we get a little slidey. Which is all good. It's not the end of the world. 88 to go. 88 miles per hour! By the way... If y'all happen to be in Southern California, come out to San Bernardino, Orange Show Speedway, right off the 10 and the 210, um, and uh, come join us because we'll have the uh, Back to the 80s throwback night happening at the Speedway that night on August 27th. We'll have a DeLorean, an actual Back to the Future DeLorean, on track <laughs> during pace laps, and uh, it'll also be in the fan zone, available for photos as well. So come on out, have some fun. We're going to be playing 80s music. We're going to dress up. Still debating who I want to go as. Somebody said we should do the Breakfast Club. The whole Speedway should dress up as the Breakfast Club, which I'm down for. But I don't know. I don't know if I could pull off Molly. I want to. I just I don't know if the hair is good, you know. We'll see. We'll have to see. 
Thank you for coming on out and checking out the stream, y'all. I really appreciate it. Come on, car. Come on, car. Come on, car. There we go. There we go. She loses. Uh, okay. Uh. Sometimes all you got to do is hold the wheel straight when she gets sideways like that, and she just got really sideways. Okay. Loose is fast and on the edge of out of control, and we are definitely on the edge of out of control. That's a four tire slide right there. So now the question is, is when do we, uh, can we hang on to this thing? Because I don't want to tighten it up, because when I tighten it up, she's going to plow and I'm going to lose a lot of time. So loose is good. Ish. Whew. I had to chase it. I had to chase it. Oh, man. Three and four, she's just another beast altogether. She's starting to get loose on the straights. Yikes. We have a lot of this race to go. We're not even at the halfway point yet. Come on. There we go, there we go, there we go. I know there's not many of you here, but I really appreciate the ones that are here. Down the back straight away. Come on. Okay, she's better there. I gotta back my corners up. Big surprise. Big surprise! I just gotta back up the corners. Look at Ryan Newman and Jimmy Johnson up in the top five. A couple of veterans now retired in real life from NASCAR racing. Jimmy tearing up the IndyCar circuit. Literally. Crashing into walls. Spinning out, tearing it up. <laughs> now he's going for it, man. I think it's just a different form of racing, and I don't want to say he's past his prime, but um, I think he he definitely knows the his better years are already behind him. But you know, he's going out there and having fun, man, and good for him. Um, he's improving slightly here and there, so he's determined. Give him another season, I think he'll get it together. I don't think he'll have a shot at the Indy 500, but maybe he will. Because one of the things you got to do in IndyCar in order to be competitive for that race is you have to build a rapport with the team all season. And tracks that he's raced on in NASCAR, he's good at in uh, in IndyCar. So Texas being one of them, his first top 10 finish out there, Texas best finish so far. And uh, Indy, I don't, I, I'm not going to say he has a shot, but I think he, he will definitely finish top 10, top 5. Uh, whether or not he'll contend for the win, that depends on how he raises that race and how his team uh, plays the offense. But, you know, time will tell. Time will definitely tell what he's got. Front straight away. You gotta love it out here. And she is... Uh, you see this? You see what I'm dealing with? Come on. Had to really chase that one, my gosh. Wow. Yeah, this thing's this thing's breaking on loose. Thank you guys for tuning into the ARN Thursday Thunder series here on Twitch. Oh, mama. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, okay, okay. Yep. Nope. Yep. Where's the caution, Nask? There's the caution. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Woo! Oh, we got hit. Of course we got hit. Hmm. Try some air pressure adjustments just to see if that does anything. Gotta just throw something out of here. Coming to the green, driver. Let's go. Ready. Got one down low now. Do you think it's slightly unethical that um, Careful, still there. Motorsport Games took BJ McLeod in that 78 and they gave him, oh hey Kyle they gave him a higher rating in this game than they should have so he keeps running top 5, top 10 and he's never even running the top 20 
I'm just saying that might be a little bit of a deceitful move right there. We got a run off too, y'all. We're good. We're good. Hey, Newman. All clear. Ah, didn't time that right. Still there. All clear. Yeah, I paid him back. I had to. I owed him one for something else. Are they on your outside? I know Hendrick and, and Willie Byron fans are probably going, Yeah, you wreck him! And yeah, I'm gonna wreck him. Clear high, bud. Still there. See, that should have spun him out right there. That should have just sent him around like there was no tomorrow. That'll do for now. Nice little draft. Thought about going three wide there for a second. My rear end was like, nah, 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 nah. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna Tokyo drift through this thing. It's gonna be great. Hey, Martin. A little bit of a shot right there for you. Quarter of this race over. Hmm. And she's a little more unstable behind cars, so this ain't helping. Oh. All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. Ish. Hmm. Starting to lose ground here, so we gotta we gotta focus on up. Come on, Martin! Come on, Martin! Give me that draft, son. Stay on the bottom here. All clear. Mm -hmm. New leader into one. Oh, can we hold it though? Can we hold it? She's starting to get a little, a little, a little, a little, a little. Oh no, 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 no! Uh, Yellow flag. Oh, that's great. Yeah, I'm gonna pit because of these tires now and this damage. So we're giving up third position. We're probably going a couple of cars playing the pit strat here. So I'm gonna tighten it up just a touch. 32nd place, ladies and gentlemen. Yowza. We're going green. Ready. I'm ready. All right, let's go. Let's go, gearheads. Let's go. Careful, still there. Got a car loaded. Whoa! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Oh, code brown, code brown. Nice. All right, Bubba clear. gave me the space. Bubba's the MVP. I got them freshies, so I got to take advantage. There's a lot of grip down here on the apron. All clear. Hey, DeBena can't finish in the top 10 in the truck series these days. Y'all still think he's talented? Because all, all the Benedetto fans shut the hell up as soon as Phoenix happened. After all Phoenix clear. and after all the crap he pulled out at Phoenix, all of his fans were like, yeah. Car outside. So I don't think I don't think his fans were real fans, I'm just saying, because they clear disappeared high. in a big bad way. Hey Kurt! Alrighty, alrighty, we're good, we're good, we're good. Hey BJ, how you doing, bud? Mm-hmm. Y'all, I dig that jump, man. 
uh, 45 paint scheme that Kurt's going to be running later this year. That was really cool. I, I looked at that, I was like, that's a car. Maybe it's my affinity for red, black, and silver, but hey, Jimmy. Oh, uh, uh. How did Truex spin out and he's up here leading the thing? Like, no big deal. Well, side by side for the lead, I should say. Good for him, but still. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Oh man, I had like no faith in the car right there. Hey, Martin. Still there. All clear. We'll be taking. Naha. Naha. Yeah, I'm gonna pit. Keep the changes. How? Fine. 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 To the green driver. Almost ready. What is with this field? They're like 4-3 wide up there. What in the world? Stay low, stay low. I know, seven times up there. I got this, Jeff. Calm down. Mm-hmm. Hey, Matt. Congrats on the Hall of Fame nod. Stay low. Alright, clear outside. Nice. Ryan Newman leading in the six car. Something that was never really said in real life. Sorry, not sorry, Newman. You think he's gonna be a jerk? Nope, not a jerk. I didn't think I was gonna be able to pass him on the high side, but uh, that worked. Cause I got the freshies over a second back to Logano, so noise. We're not even at the halfway point still. We have to be pitting here in about nine laps. Whoa! She hit one of those bumps, and she was like, "Yeah, I'm gonna go for a four-wheel slide." It's all right. I caught her back up. She's good. She's good now. Sending it, sending it. We are unstable. Ah! No, 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 no. Ah! Yellow flag. Ah. And they're piling up behind me. That's 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 wonderful. Yeah, we're gonna pit. I'm gonna just let it play out so I can take a bite of Samo. Bite! I got a deep fried fillet here. Mm-hmm. 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 That'll do. That'll do. Mm-hmm. Why not? All right, you're coming to the green. Almost ready. Let's go. Let's go. Hold your line. That one inside. My dog goes over on the couch, cuddling with my Still wife. There. I'm jelly. Ah! Clear low. I was flirting with my wife, and I almost missed the turn. <laughs> Oops. It's okay, it's okay. We're on this high side. We got this. Maybe. Hey, Newman. Whoa, 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 man. You don't say. Yeah, I'm gonna pit, cause, oh, oh, am I just gonna, or, oh, <laughs> cool. I didn't think, I thought we were gonna hit him there for a second. So yeah, I'm gonna pit. There's no limit on how many times you can pit, so yeah, I'm gonna pit and, uh, Bring that wedge up. Uh, I'm gonna take the grill tape down just to try things. John Hunter Nima truck. Oh no! Coming to the green driver. Almost ready. Green down. Let's go. Not bad. Oh, this inside line stacking up. Thirty-seven. Careful, 
still there. All right, clear low. Couple away from the halfway point of this race. Be on this high side. Bottom. Thanks, Quinn. All right, you're clear. Thanks for giving me the space, bud. Starcom for the win right there. Clear high, clear high. Hey, Matt. Hi, Matt. Yeah, buddy. Clear high, bud. All right, you're clear. Hey, Cole. Bye, Cole. All right, clear outside. All clear. All clear. Outside, Yo, outside. we sent it. Right, we sent outside. it. And it worked up to 13. Although Jones in that 20 car is a little peeve. It's all good. Still there. You're all clear up top. Look at BJ can't BJ has a competitive advantage because the video game creators like him because they sponsor him, and he still can't run top ten, y'all. Man, even when this game tries to cheat, it can't it can't pull it off. Go figure. Hey Denny. Bye Denny. Back up into the top five for now. Yeah, the tape definitely helped out a lot with this thing. She feels a lot more stable. Careful, still there. Alright, clear outside. Got a car high now. How did Logano come out on top of that? Come here, Joey. Got a car low now. Clear high, bud. Caution. Got him. He only dropped a six, though, so go figure. Um, yeah, we'll pit. Figure every time we get a caution, I'll just pit. Screw it, right? Coming to the green, driver. Let's go. All right, dig driver. Whoa, they're stacking again. It's the 37 again on this bottom with his damage. Was that the halfway point? That was the halfway point. Grip. Go. Inside. Here comes Willie. We're good. All right, clear outside. Is that my baby girl being put into the into her little bed? And yes, y'all, that is my wife right there in frame. Hi, wife. You're you're being seen. She's like, no. She was discharged last night from the hospital. Thank you all for the good well wishes, comments, and prayers, and she's gonna go hide in the bedroom because she wants to do actual work. No joke, she uh, she returned to work today. She's working from home today, so. Yeah. She's, she's one of those dedicated, committed employees who like cares about her clients and, you know, takes care of them and all that good stuff. So, you know, she helps a lot of people, y'all. I'm very proud of her, if you can't tell already. The day after the hospital, she's like, yeah, I'm going back. That's my wife. Oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm wheeling it. We're good. Try to get some laps in here, y'all. That'd be nice. Not the wrong button. So, eight more laps on this uh, fuel run. We have yet to go a fuel run. I think it'd be cool to do some green flag pit stops here, but, uh, you know, we just uh, keep spinning out. So, who knows? We might get lucky here, and actually it might happen. Oh, that was dicey. I'm only going to do that going down the back stretch from now on. MTJ got around Newman, and he is... Not Coleman, but, like, he's hanging a lot better than the rest of the field, so that's good. Much more stable-ish. Down 
here on the apron. 46 laps to go out here at Auto Club Speedway in Fontana, California. Only a few miles away from Orange Show Speedway, the quarter mile flat track that has been in operation for 75 years in San Bernardino, California. Log on to orangeshowspeedway.org. Check them on out. Oh. We're good. We're good. Make it to the green flag pit stops. That's all I want to do. And the field is spreading out, so hopefully 45 to go here, we'll be able to hit pit road in about five, six laps here. Actually, let's see when we go down to five laps so we can kind of calculate where we gotta where we gotta go. As you can see, I'm riding that high line already. The grippy is a lose. We're losing the grippy. All right, so back straight away. So I could putt putt around here through three and four. So we'll we'll pit in five laps if we get there. Still wants to break loose off badly, but we're holding on to her for now. Oh, and there it goes. I didn't do it, clearly. I missed caution replays. No changes, let's go. What? That was weird. So we had three cars stay out, Quinn Hoff, Matt Kenseth, Ryan Newman. But we were the first car on and off pit road, so these guys are off pit sequence, so. All right, we'll see if we can pit in 11 laps under green then. We should have to pit at least three more times, if not more, depending on how these cautions fall. Where's MTJ? Man, he's he. We tried to split the field right there, but I got the runoff on the high side. Hey, how you doing, guys? Come on, MTJ, follow me, bud. I'll show you where you gotta go. Oh, he's a following. Uh huh. Uh huh. I'm gonna work the bottom, cause uh, he's making it work. Let's see if I can hit this properly. Okay, not bad. Not great, but not bad. We're getting there. We're getting there, y'all. Oh! I messed that up. I messed that up. We're good. Can you dig it? 39 to go. So at least three more pit stops, roughly. I feel like as long as we get a pit... If we get a caution with less than 10 to go, I'll pit and just send it through this field and see what we got. Because we got a great car. She's not perfect, but she got a lot of speed in her, so... You know, it's just, it's fine tooth in it. And I think we've done that throughout the race. We're a little bit behind on changes. So maybe this pit stop, I'll experiment a little bit. And then the second pit stop, I'll, uh, I'll fine tooth it a little bit. Another couple pit stops here, I think. So yay to go. And you can see our fast laps we haven't been running blisteringly fast. We're still a few tenths off of what our record is here. Just because the car is just not wonderful. But it's all good. We're, we're coming through this field slowly but surely. Or we came through the field slowly but surely. And we're hanging out in the top five for the most part and running up here. So I have faith. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
try something. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Boy, that was dicey. Man, we pulled away, but, you know, MTJ, he's our closest competitor, I feel. He's, he's got the car we gotta, he's the car we gotta beat. 36 to go, 6 on fuel. Where do we go to 5? I'm guessing coming off a 2. Or halfway down the back straightaway. Hmm, not even coming off a 2, in 2. Gotcha. So we're going to try to save a little bit of fuel, because I'd like to stretch this to 5 laps, and... If we're running out, if we're hitting zero midway down the back, Powers call to caution. never mind. Throwing some stuff at it. Let's go. We maintain the lead coming off pit road, the whole field pitted, which hasn't happened in a hot minute, so we're all in the same pit cycle here with how many to go? About 30, 32? 11, 33, and 11 on fuel, so we will try to uh, make this thing last. Should have at least one more pit stop. Nice. Nice run right there. All right, we're good. Pulled away by a second on that lap. Car feels a lot more stable, but it's not so much now because when those new tires are in, life's good. It's, it's what happens five laps into the run is what matters. Oh, somebody got it. Somebody had some fun down there. See those tire marks? That looked like fun. We're good. We're good. How good a lap was that? Fastest lap of the day right there for us. So we, the adjustments clearly working. Not right there in that turn, but you know, they're working. Still a little off of where we were. So taking the tape off the grill clearly helped. Helped to tighten this thing up a little bit, thank goodness. But she's still very unstable through these turns. She wants to snap around loose on me, and she's fighting me, so, you know, having to wheel it. But 30 laps to go. We're going to have to pit at least one more time, probably two more times. It just depends on how cautions fall. If we get a caution right now, it throws everything out the window. If we get a caution in five laps, that'll help. That would help. See, they're battling behind us. Here's the leaderboard. Several cars already out of the race, and for some reason the game parks them on pit road, so that's cool, I guess. Yeah, I had to chase it. I had to chase it. Man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Hmm.
nice little hefty lead from Newman right here, but... Five laps till we pit. When does it go to four? Because now we got to try to time it. So we're going to be pitting with about 23 to go, roughly. <clears throat> when does it go to four? There it is, right off of two. So we'll pit in four laps. I can stretch this back straight away and the turn getting on pit road, I think. And I'm going to start backing up these corners so that we can save just a tiny little bit, get some extra, extra fuel out of this, uh, extra mileage, I should say, out of this fuel run. Question is, is will we stay green? Will we go another four laps here? Let's see, letting off, coasting, 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 coasting. That'll help with the fuel, but we'll lose some ground, but it's all good because we're going to, I don't know, I'm on the fence. You can see we're still at four, three going down the back straightaway, so we just saved a quarter of a lap right there practically. So letting off and coasting in this game does significantly help out with uh, with that, but it looks like we already got some cars on pit road, at least one car on pit road. Interesting. 25 to go. Let's see where we go this time. It's halfway down the back straightaway last lap. Getting it into three? Yep, into three. Nice. Keep coasting. Because at this point, I can go the full two laps around this place and make it on a pit road. If she runs out going into three and four, I can still coast it around. And she'll putt putt until the ba oh yeah, that's a smoker. Oh, that's Bubba, Bubba Wallace. Bubba Wallace on pit road with something broken in. Pete stops have started. Jimmy Johnson cycles back out to the second position, so he stays out. But it looks like MTJ and everybody else who was running in the top five has come down pit road. So here things are gonna get interesting. How are we gonna cycle out here? We're gonna go one more lap, because we can stretch it, and that extra lap of fuel might be the difference here in about 23 laps. We're definitely gonna have to pit, copy that, Jeff, we're definitely gonna have to pit one more time, but two more pit stops, we're about to make our second to last pit stop, and no changes on this car. She's handling pretty well. Obviously, we're pulling away, and we're holding on to her, so we finally caught up with the pit, with the, the changes. As you can see, some cars coming off pit road right in front of us. Boy, pit road's gonna be a little bit busy, but uh, we will pit here. We don't really have a choice. We're about to run out, so. I'm trying to remember what the what the pit road speed limit is, but I cannot remember for the life of me. Slow down. Made it, cool. Wasn't the best, but we made it. All right, I think we're good. No changes here, four tires. Let's go, boys and girls as I dig into some of my chipotle honey crusted salmon. Oh, and we have a caution. All right. In theory, we're gonna make this pit stop and then we should be okay. I made it on pit road, so we should be okay. We should cycle back out to the lead here. In theory, I got freshy tires, so. We leading. I take it. Coming 
to the green, driver. You ready? <clears throat> so 11 laps on fuel here. That caution helps us. Yeah, so we're going to be pitting with about 9 to go. I'm going to pit early, I think. How eerie is it that the thumbnail I picked was Jimmy Johnson? Leading over, I think it was Kurt Busch and someone else. It's a little eerie, right? I'm, it's not just me. Johnson got kicked to the high side. And he is losing ground to Logano. Johnson's been barely inside the top 10. Well, inside the top 5 barely, but he's been hanging out inside the top 10. I don't think he has a great car, but probably better than what he uh, is capable of out here. So, uh, Logano moves up to second. Logano's, I believe, won here before. Or come very close to it. Harvick's definitely won out here before. We've won out here before. I know this track extremely well. Extremely well. After 25 years of going to races out here, I think I know the track very well. It's my hometown track. It's only about... I want to say 15 miles away from where I'm currently sitting. At my home. Uh, okay. We're good. Mm -mm. She wanted to step out on me right there. That was fun. We will not be able to make it from here. Oh, man. No, we can't make it from here, so we're going to stay out with the rest of the field. going to get interesting. We should be restarting with about 13, 14 to go, somewhere around there. Should have pitted, man. I could have chanced it. When does it go to six is my big question. Because now, like ever, almost every race out here at Auto Club for the first 12 years, it comes down to a fuel mileage race. When does it go to... Okay, right at the line, practically. All right. Well, that helps, because I can essentially take it to one to go. And uh, still be good. That's cool. That works with me. That works for me! Getting a little loose, a little unstable. Yeah, we're pulling away with 11 to go. So if the caution comes out now, we can make it from here. So bring on the caution. The whole field wants to see the caution, including me. But if not, we'll make our only green flag pit stop. I got on pit road that fine that first time, but we only got to start the first half of that green flag pit stop, so. Oi. Thank you to ARN for sponsoring the ARN Thursday Thunder Series. Log on to AmericanRacingNetwork.com to keep up on all the latest motorsport news you need to know. ARN, the motorsport Ten authority. To Ten to go. Mm-hmm. 
and keep an eye on ARN because we're going to be announcing uh, the sponsor of um, the NR2003 uh, subscriber series. That should be a whole lot of fun. If you guys want to be a part of that series, you don't have to race it yourself. You just have to drop a comment over on twitter.com forward slash hey Alan Bailey, the pin tweet. Uh, let us know what car number you want to run and the first and last name that you would like to run on that car. Whether it's, you know, my wife, you know, she's running uh, Gabbeth Mighty. So um, her tag is just Gabbeth the Mighty. So she's running Gabbeth Mighty as her two names. I'm running Alan Bailey. Um, you know, our, our series sponsor is going to be running it himself. His car is already in the game, too. So is mine and hers. Her car, I had a hand in designing it, and it might be the mo the coolest car in NR2003. Truly. I'm actually really so, uh, excited about her car. And uh, I'm driving an ARN car, which I'm excited about. But uh, I'm, more, I'm more jelly for her car, because she's actually got a really, really, really cool car. Yep, we're good. We're good. We're good. Do I see beat, beat stops already? I mean, maybe. You're almost out of gas. Copy that. Man, I don't trust it. I wanna, I wanna go one more lap here. See if a caution comes out. Because if we pit and get trapped a lap down, I'm gonna be so furious. Seven to go. One to go on fuel, no? For now, it's one to go on fuel. So, some beat stops happening right here. Yeah, we're gonna come down this time. And yeah, I'm gonna slap four on it, and, uh... No adjustments. I know, Jeff. Thank you. Thank you, Jeff. I don't know what I would do without you. Okay, okay, I should be on the bottom. We would. We're going to have to go rights only in order to uh, help with that penalty. I was just trying to get too much. I was trying to get too much. Uh, that's what happens when you push it. Do we have to go in slow motion here, guys? Go fast! And there's a caution. You know what? Since most of the field is trapped a lap down, we're actually going to pit here. Why not? Four tires and fuel. We're 19th. Uh, strap on in, gearheads. Three laps out here. We're 19th. Let's see what we got here. Doesn't matter how good you are. Comes out to a green-white checkered. Plus two laps. Way to go, Balicki. Hold him up, pal. Champ right there. Now we got the runoff. All right, we got the four freshies. We're going places, y'all. Come on. We only got a few laps to go. Two to go. Two to go. This is going to be some Earnhardt stuff right here, y'all. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Up to six. Two to go. Coming to the white flag this time by. Up to fifth. Oh, yeah, I'm going to send it down here. Oh, man. Oh, she almost spun out right there. Oh, we're good. Yeah, Kyle, give me the push. Kyle Bush pushing us faster. His brother. Oh, coming to the white. Three wide for the lead back there. We get away for now. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Hang on, gearheads. 
white flag right here is we're gonna wheel it through here but she's still a little unstable here comes the 18 car though Kyle Busch, Alex Bowman, Kevin Harvick, Joey Logano, your top five, but we are leading white flag right here in the hometown. All right, don't blink. Oh, good run. Oh, she hooked up. Oh, she hooked up like she hadn't in a few laps. Thank you, car. Thank you all for coming out to the Thursday, the ARN Thursday Thunder Series stream right here on Twitch. If you haven't already, if you're watching on YouTube, make sure that you mash that subscribe button, not only on YouTube, but on twitch.tv forward slash Hey Allen Bailey. And don't look now, y'all. We qualify for the playoffs and win in the hometown. Woo! Bitch, we won. We won, mama. Let's do some burnouts. Nine times out of ten, I'm right there in Victory Lane watching this. But it's cool to finally get a win. I know it's two races in, but still. Pressure's off now. We have qualified for the postseason. And we are in. And yeah, we do have playoffs. Woo. So, oi. I always said if I, come on. I'm gonna come down here to three and four because I remember sitting all, or excuse me, one and two. I remember sitting all the way down here at pit exit practically, thinking, oh man, if they would just come down here and do some burnouts. So that's what I'm gonna do for these fans. That way everybody can get their cool photo. my take on a Polish victory lap. Now the reason it's called a Polish victory lap is because Alan Kowicki was, God rest his soul, was Polish, proud Polishman. And uh, the media and him named it the Polish victory lap after him and his heritage. And pe people have accused that of being racist. I don't think it's uh, racist so much because nobody frowns upon this uh, victory lap whatsoever it's actually very cool winning in the custom car too doesn't hurt at all so now that we have made the playoffs we can kind of uh, have some fun with this series the pressure's off now until week 10 it's just a matter of can we uh... oh come on car go forward <laughs> She just wants to do more donuts and burnouts for these fans. I get it. We're good. Backwards. Doink. Didn't get a scratch on her the whole... Well, no, I got multiple scratches on her this whole race, but... Uh, normally there's people here, I'd be sitting here, but that's all good. I dig it. I dig it a lot. Let's check out the replays here. Oh, Nemechek goes for a spin. That ended his day early. You hate to see it. <laughs> Little bit of payback. Little bit of payback. Ooh. Yeah, that was that was my bad right there. Mm 
Ooh, that was Logano. Oh, Logano up and in the air. Oh, man. Oops. How did he finish this race? I want to check this out. Yowza. That's, that's definitely not good, y'all. Logano barrel rolling in the background. Let's take another look at that. Nope. So we spin out Logano, and he gets absolutely T-boned here, and he goes for a ride. There's no way around that. <laughs> he went he he went for a ride. He definitely went for a ride right there. Oh well. He irked me, so that's that's what you get ultimately. So that's good, that's fine. But you could see uh, we get the victory over, and Lee finishes second. Like, what are the odds of that? But Logano, Kyle Busch, Alex Bowman, Kevin Harvick, Kurt Busch, Ryan Blaney, Jimmy Johnson, Christopher Bell and Denny Hamlin, your top 10. So a good, strong uh, Toyota day right there, getting the victory. Here's 11th through 20th. You can see Josh Balicki coming up in there with the top 20. Good for him. Same with Brendan Gone. Matt Kenseth, Hall of Famer right there up there as well. You can see uh, only 20 cars on the lead lap. So MTJ, who had a very dominant car, got trapped a lap down due to that late race caution. BJ, William Byron also trapped a lap down, sub-20th right there. Justin Haley, Ricky Stenhouse Jr. back here. Then we look outside at the rest of the field. You see another spin right there. Nema truck. Yep, that'll do it. But you could see cars who had unfortunate days. Uh, you got Benedetto, who just ran out of town and finished 34th. Um, the 37 car who... Had multiple problems and did not finish the race. Cars that uh, finished the race in the garage, Bubba Wallace, Tyler Reddick, Ty Dillon, Michael McDowell, John Hunter, Nima Truck, who went out early on. And there we are spinning and almost getting in, almost hitting the, the 19 right there. But we somehow kept it off the wall, thank goodness. So cool victory for us, very cool victory for us. You can see we are tied with Kurt Busch, currently in the playoff picture right there or excuse me no we're leading Kurt right there uh by two whole points right now it is a round of 16 that we're doing so right now on the outside looking in you have um or excuse me locked in in the playoffs right now but not locked in you have Harvick Blaney Bush Bowman Logano Hamlin Keselowski Truex uh Elliot Amarola Jones <laughs> BJ is in the playoffs at the moment Jimmy Johnson and Chris Bell on the outside looking in. You have Custard, Busher, Byron, Balicki, Newman, Dillon, Fincham, Suarez, Kenseth, Reddick, Benedetto, Pierce, Stenhouse, and Reagan inside the top 30. Here's what the rest of the point situation looks like. Um, man, John Hunter Nemechek having just a horrendous start to his season. Same with uh, Bubba Wallace and uh, Michael McDowell. So, yeah tough right there but you can see we are back in victory lane here thank you so much for watching if you haven't already mash that subscribe button it helps us out so darn much when you do make sure that you also give us a follow over on the social media accounts at hey alan bailey and that uh you also check us out over on youtube.com forward slash hey alan bailey we are in victory lane at auto club speedway for the arn thursday thunder series i'm alan bailey thank you so much for watching We'll see you next Thursday at 3 p.m. Eastern. That is noon Pacific on twitch.tv forward slash Hey Alan Bailey. We'll see you at the track, Gearheads.